People ask me what's in this cup. What's in the sauce? You know what I tell them? Magic. That's good. <laughs> I went back to Knoxville, pretty much feeling like a loser and didn't know what I was gonna do with my life at that point. And listen to me, whoever's listening out there, if there's something you wanna do and you believe in it, don't give up. Carlos, you catch up? Enjoy, dude. Hi, Localish, my name's Josh Gatewood, and I own a food truck in New York City called Yankee Doodle Dandies. We've been doing food trucks in New York City since 2013. I've gotten about six hours of sleep the last three days trying to get ready for Comic-Con, and you know what? We're making a lot of money. I'm here, second day in a row, coming to Yankee Doodle Dandy. That is so awesome! This is totally cool! Thanks, brother. A free take. So, the coolest thing about my truck is the backstory. So, in the middle of September of 2012, I threw some stuff in my car and just left New York. I went back to Knoxville, pretty much feeling like a loser and didn't know what I was gonna do with my life at that point. I figured, what's the best way to get out of my situation? Who wants to be a millionaire? I got a phone call that Monday and says, hey, this is Taylor from Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? She says, you're on the show on Thursday. And I barely had enough money to, to, to get back up there. I said, oh crap. So I took a mega bus from Knoxville, Tennessee, back to New York. But I'd like to set them up here in New York. I'd like to start my own all-American uh, Southern fried chicken restaurant, all organic. I oh, like to very call it nice. Yankee Doodle Dandies to fit the all-American motif. Uh, so that's the plan what I'm gonna do when I win the million. I won some money on the game show. I didn't win enough for a restaurant, so what I'd get, I got a food truck. This chicken is delicious. So if you come to Yankee Doodle Dandies, the thing you want to try is obviously our chicken tenders. It says it all over the truck, the best chicken tenders you'll ever eat. They're marinated, then brined, and we hand bread them in the truck, fry them in oil, and they come out crispy. This right here is the magic. Spirit of 76 sauce. People ask me what's in this cup. What's in the sauce? You know what I tell them? Magic. That's good. <laughs> I'm just grateful to live where we do. And that's what I love about the food truck business is that it represents the American dream. You got people from every which corner of the globe. I could go up and down this line of trucks right here and there's people from so many different countries going after the American dream. Listen to me, whoever's listening out there. If there's something you want to do and you believe in it, don't give up. You are a winner, winner. You are a winner, winner.